Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. While the desired outcome is the same for the Levels command as the Auto Levels command, you can manually adjust the levels using the Levels command to precisely control the results. With the Levels command, you can adjust up to 256 different tones that can give you a much more natural finished look than the Brightness Contrast command can. To manually adjust the levels, select Enhance, Adjust Lighting, Levels from the menu bar. The Levels dialog box then appears where you can make your selections. The histogram shows how the pixels in the image are distributed at each of the 256 brightness levels with shadows at the left, midtones in the middle, and highlights to the right. While you can use the channel drop down to select any of the available color channels, you generally want to make your changes in the RGB channel. There are three eyedroppers under the buttons in this dialog box. Black, gray, and white. Click each of the eyedroppers and select pixels in the image that best represent the three colors. For gray, try to find a point within the image with equal parts red, green, and blue. If you need help identifying the parts of the image that if you need help identifying the parts of the image that are the most black, white, and gray, elements can help. Select Window, then Info from the menu bar to launch the Info panel. With this panel open, pass your mouse cursor over the image to see the R, G, and B color levels change. Since black is the total absence of color, the RGB levels should be at their lowest level when you find the blackest part of the image. The opposite is true for white. You can also You can also use the output sliders to adjust the levels for even more precise manual control. When you are when you are happy with your results, click the OK button in the Levels dialog box. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.